Okay, good. So I'm just going to go ahead and kind of go down this list and uh, see if we can make some heads or tails out of this. Um, first thing on the list is uh, uh, about the ketonics drink in general and why is it both unique and beneficial. The ketonics drink is really the only way that you can get a packaged product um, that's convenient and portable that will deliver ketone bodies um, to you uh, very, very very affordable and very easy. It is the really the only way to introduce these ketone bodies into the body uh, without having to put the body through a, a regimented ketogenic diet that would be uh, required to get these ketones. Um, so basically what are exogenous ketones? They're, they are uh, exogenous version, man-made versions of the ketones that we actually produce in the body, which are beta-hydroxybutyrate, acetoacetate and acetone. So in this particular ketonics drink, we are using beta-hydroxybutyrate exclusively. It is the easiest transportable uh, of the ketone bodies uh, that we produce. So it's stable in blood, it's stable in the gut, stable in plasma, and it's a very powerful delivery mechanism of ketone bodies to peripheral tissue. Um, the, the other ketone bodies that are produced endogenously or by the liver are not stable in the body and they actually decarboxylate and disappear quite rapidly. Um, so beta-hydroxybutyrate is the preferential ketone um, and that's what we have decided that we were going to go for in the ketonic strength. Um, do ketones, how do ketones work? Um, really simplistically, ketones are a very special modified short-chain fatty acid. And we don't get short-chain fatty acids uh, readily in, in foods. We get them a little bit in butter and some, some other things, but definitely not in any quantities. And what happens when we go into a dietary state where we reduce carbohydrates, the body has to produce a suitable fuel to replace the glucose with, and it has to be a suitable fuel that's easily oxidized in the brain. Um, the fact that we mobilize from long-chain fatty acids, which are what we mobilize from stored body fat, um, do not readily cross into the brain to fuel the brain. They have to be short-chain fatty acids. And so what the liver does when we start dieting is it produces these ketone bodies as it's using uh, long-chain fatty acids for other tissues in the body. So it's, a, 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 it's, a, it's not a, fl a flight or flight type response, but it is a definite response to energy restriction in times of famine or in times of diet to make sure that the brain gets a powerful, suitable fuel that's going to replace the glucose that you're taking away from it when you're on a restricted carbohydrate diet. So um, if you, uh, ketone bodies are also, because of the nature of how they're designed and the environment that they're utilized in, they're also very tissue protective. So now that you're utilizing fat for energy, you have less oxidation, you have less um, reactive oxygen species, you have less inflammation in the cells, a much cleaner burning fuel than glucose is. So you can, if you can imagine if the brain is utilizing these for energy source now, you're not going to have the emissions and the, and the, uh, uh, the detrimental waste products from a fuel such as glucose in the brain. And this is what we are, we're pretty positive is the cause, of, the root cause of most of the uh, cognitive and uh, neurological degenerative diseases is the fact that the brain has been burning glucose as a fuel for so long and it's never had a chance to burn a clean fuel like ketone bodies be simply because of our, our westernized diet. It's so comprehensive in carbohydrate that we never really get a chance to go into ketosis. So the beauty of the drink in general is it allows you to get all the benefits of ketone bodies that would be normally produced on a strict diet without actually having to go through the buy-in and the regimen of, of being on that diet. Um, so simply, what is ketosis? Ketosis is a state of having ketone bodies available for fuel in the body. That's, that's what ketosis is. And I'll, I'll just briefly give you a couple of buzzwords. So ketogenesis is actually the process where the liver would produce ketones. The ketonics drink doesn't do ketogenesis because it's already made. It's in the drink. So you have ketosis where it's in the body. You have ketogenesis where ketones are produced. And you have a word called ketolysis, where ketone bodies are actually being utilized by tissue. So it's manufacturing, transport, utilization, those three things. You might want to write those down and, and or look them up, because uh, they'll probably come up in topic that you have with your, with your downlines. Um, ketones and athletic performance, or any kind of performance. So being a fat 
a ketone body requires less oxygen per unit of energy than carbohydrate. So benefits for athletes, uh, most definitely uh, distance and endurance type athletes where they will actually consume less oxygen to produce the same amount of energy as you would burning a glucose or a carbohydrate source. Um, so that's a definite performance benefit. I know personally when I when I go to the gym and I, I train that I don't get winded nearly as much as I do on a on a, a glucose diet as I do taking the ketone product. So that would be the number one performance benefit for for athletes. And then uh, we briefly covered uh, cognitive benefits. And again, the biggest cognitive benefit to ketone bodies is their ability to produce a substantial amount of energy without producing the uh, detrimental waste products that glucose have, and this is going to be, uh, I, I believe personally, a game changer in the ability to reverse and prevent cognitive decline in, in uh, neurological tissue um, and, and cancer. Uh, lastly, and not least, if you want to throw cancer in there, same thing. Cancer cells love to burn glucose. They can't stand to burn ketone bodies. So we have uh, very, very uh, interesting uh, data and, and test subjects that we're working with right now in anti-cancer therapy utilizing ketone bodies. Um, very, very promising, and we have some data that, that simply could, could never be replicated with traditional uh, medical therapies, including chemotherapy. So this is a very, very powerful tool. It's a very powerful addition to a diet that you may already be on, um, but as a standalone product, it's, it's unsurpassed, and we've really never seen anything like this in the, uh, in the health and wellness arena for, for decades. This is truly a, a revolutionary product and a very, um, very substantial way of delivering a very powerful tool.